you? Oh my God, I used to I feel love like I fit in. pants. With the you do? You yeah. do. You are ready for the <laughs> Kelly Clarkson show. Have y'all met a little mm -hmm. before? Oh, we'll meet each other. There yeah. you go. Nice Good to, meet, to you. meet you. You too. Um, so Good you, so you, I hear that you take from your friends' lives. A, so a comedians lot. do that, and sometimes it's frowned upon okay. upon their friends. Okay. Do your friends <laughs> like it when you? Well, use I don't their tell lives? them. Oh. <laughs> I, I mean, they've got to know. They find and out. Though, they probably. Fi they yeah. probably find out. Got it. Yeah. yeah, but I think um, I think it's it's nice because my life is just very, very drama free, which is amazing. Oh, a boring life is a wonderful life. It is yes. a wonderful yeah. life, but yeah. it's also nice to have a lot of friends that get into situations that is the opposite of yeah. that. Uh, but yeah. But yeah, material. you love who you love is about you know being with someone. You're basically sitting down with your friend and you're telling them, stand up. You yeah. deserve someone so much better because you are amazing, incredible, yeah. deserving, beautiful, and why are you with this person who does yeah. not treat you like that, you know? Which there's not a lot of songs out there with that message, mm. by the way. I heard it and I was like, this is a great idea for a song. I was like, yeah. you don't really hear it. And I think it's quite it. relatable. Yeah. I think, I mean, I've definitely been in both situations. Yeah, Where, with friend and in the situation. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. I think so, I think we all it's have. It's fun. Yeah. yeah. It's a great beat too. It's so catchy. You hear it one Thank time you. and it's like in there. Thank. I feel like Sweden is very good at that. Yes. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Um, do you ever do that with like characters? I know you direct episodes on this. Is that? Do you ever? I don't know, put some of your life in, into some of the characters you Yeah, play? I try to do it all the time, as much mm -hmm. as yeah? I possibly can. Yeah, it do you, helps does you. Your family, do your family and friends like that or no? Um, yeah, you know, I never, I never, I just deny it. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> just a yeah. solid, oh, I don't know what They're you're talking about. People are finding out a lot about me today, Kelly. Yeah. <laughs> this is, yeah. Some incredible, you can always say sorry later. Oh, yeah, yeah, exactly. Right. Um, I heard that, this is interesting, you took a trip to Thailand recently, but you, yeah. something to do with eels, you bought eels? I did, it's yeah, we went to the thing. market. And I said, what is that? They're so small. And they say you can buy them to release them for good karma. So that's what we did. We got some eels. We got nine eels um, for luck. And then we released them. And uh, then later on, we went actually on a fishing trip and got nine fishes. So it felt very much you put like... put it in there and you, t you, you, you give it and <laughs> take it. <laughs> very much like a circle of life. Yeah. Um, so good karma for the eels and me, not good karma for the fish. No. Yeah, <laughs> not so much. Yeah. But you used them, you ate them, it was yeah, fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, are you an, an adventurous eater? Are you, do you have yeah, you? definitely. Okay. I'll I be down for anything. Be. Yeah, what's the weirdest thing that you Well, had? usually I don't want to know what it is until after I've consumed it. Right. Don't tell me, because then it yummy, gets in my head. Yeah. yeah. And then afterwards, I'm like, Hmm. <laughs> yeah, but I yeah. I don't know. I've tried random stuff. I don't know what the most random is, but just yeah. traveling and touring everywhere. No, totally. Yeah. 100%. And things that are weird for us might not be are, weird and are somewhere else. Sometimes a delicacy mm -hmm. for the other. They're have like, you ever been to Vietnam? Yes. No. They have a thing called, uh, I got an adventurous meal for yeah. you. Yeah. They've got a thing called, I think it's called a bullet, B, B, bullet? Oh, it's the, it's in, for, you know what this in is? the Philippines have that as well, Is it? Right? So it's like, is the oh, egg? there it is. You want to eat that yeah, thing? Yeah. <laughs> No, that's for, it, that's real. That's real. It doesn't look very appetizing. No, no, it doesn't. But it will be it? It's a delicacy, yeah. I would think you, it's a almost. Uh, I would try it. You would try I would it. try it. It's a it's a it's that's a, a hard chicken. pass for me. That's yeah, like that's a, a fetus for chicken. Me, yeah. No, see, even yeah. any fetus is involved. <laughs> I'm usually out. Okay. Yeah, I I know. Okay. It would come. It would see it again. It would come right back up. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I couldn't. It can't look like that. No, right. no, no. Maybe if it was cooked or something. Mm. I don't know. But mm. that's gonna live in my memory, y'all. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> so you recently. This is actually pretty empowering. You bought your master's recently, I did. which is very cool. It's very yeah. important for a lot of women. Especially if you're a writer, because I, I sense that it's like your babies. It's your it life. It really is. Yeah, yeah. You're so right. I yeah. mean, I started out when I first got signed and started, you know, performing and stuff. I didn't write my songs. Mm -hmm. um, that was something that I, that I did first with Never Forget You, yeah. uh, with m and &E And uh, before that, I mean, I started releasing songs when I was 15, so I had like a, a catalog already. Um, and even with songs that I didn't write were just such a huge part of my identity as an artist. Yeah. Uh, and it feels really, like you say, empowering to just mm -hmm. own that and have that. And you control where be, it goes, how exactly, it's used. Exactly, yeah. exactly. And you know, we all saw what happened to Taylor. Yeah. And um, Ola Huacanson, who ran the, the company who sold it to me, was just like, I would never want to be that person. I think that if you want to own them, what he was stand up. selling. Yeah, wow. he was selling them, and he was like, I would never ask someone else if, 
if you want them, I would like for you to have them. So I thought that was a very... It's, that it is, is the, rare, it's, by the yeah, way. Yeah, but it is the right thing to do. Yeah. And it is, it's sad At least that it's so option. rare. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah, sad yeah. That it's so rare for artists to have that control of their own work and art. Yeah. I'm very thankful and for that. And how it's used. Yeah. Yeah, it's really important to a lot of artists. So I think that's really cool, especially oh, really. telling the story of like, you always hear the bad ones about yeah. people in the industry. Mm. So it's nice that you're Shout spreading out to like, yeah, yeah. there's some really stand up yeah. humans. Yeah. <laughs> Your new album is called Venus. Yes. So what's different? This is the fourth one, right? This is the fourth one, yeah. What's different I feel about like, this one for you? As I said, starting out, I felt very much like a performer. You know, I've always been on stage, but the, the older I get and the more involved I get in, in making it, I feel like I'm more of like an artist, you know? Yeah. I'm like, I'm writing now. I'm I feel like in the beginning, now. you're kind of like, I'm what do I like, what do I want? Totally. And then you kind of start forming. Yeah. Yeah. I feel like I'm still, on. it's like an onion, you know? You peel, yeah. you peel every layer, and you get closer and closer to the essence of who you are. Mm -hmm. But um, I just feel like I felt really free making it. I felt like it was such a fun experience. It's a beautiful collection of, of love songs. Yeah. Um, and up-tempo uh, ballads. Up -tempo of, ballads. Yeah. It, it's, it's a bit... For, there's something for everyone on there. And, Which is like um, a full body dynamic. record. Nice. Yes, I cannot wait to perform it live. I think it's going to be the most amazing show. Do you think about that? I think about that. Whenever I I'm in the that. studio, I'm like, yeah. how am I going to want uh -huh. it? Like, how would I want this live? Yeah. Absolutely. Because that's so, a whole different feeling, like it, when you it go really see is. it live. But that's where my heart's at. Like Me too. Performing, mm -hmm. you know, performing live is really what I'm all about. Because then by the time you get to the live performance, I feel mm -hmm. like it's, it's probably like when you go over a script, y'all do, do many scenes. It's like... Yeah. Then you get that one, you've lived with it for a minute, and you get that one scene, and you're like, oh, that was it. Like, Absolutely. that was, that's yeah. how I feel. Like, There's once I've toured like it a bit, I'm like, yeah, I'm like, mm -hmm. oh, you do it live, and it just kind of becomes what it was supposed to become. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. 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 Well, congratulations. Thank you. The song is so good. I, I've, I've heard this song, I haven't heard the whole album yet, so I'm super stoked. I'm a fan. Uh, let's take another short break, everybody. Check out Zara's new album, Venus, wherever you get your music.